Hey y'all, Jan from an Alaskan Crafter here. How's everybody doing? We're doing okay. Uh, Jeff Lope went and ran some errands while I went and visited with our son, our daughter, and little man. Had a good time. Uh, did a little bit of time with little man. He had to take a nap. He was getting a little mm, cranky. <laughs> Kind of like his nana, nanny does when she gets a little tired in the afternoon. She gets a little cranky. Okay, today's video is going to be some acquisition and some happy mail. Um, I'm going to kind of do this stuff in segments so you're not here a whole bunch for a long time <laughs> for just... Yarn porn. That's all it is, is yarn porn, except for some bags. Ella had uh, some bags for sale, and I saw this spider one, and I had to get it. Spooky, spooky Halloween, and all about that. And I have this one that she made for me when I won one of her giveaways. I have the actual bag, it's a tote bag. So I thought, what the hey, I'll just get the Notions pouch. And it's lined and it's lightly padded. This one was a drawstring, I'll set that there. There's no particular order with this. Um, this came from Dawn Aaron. And uh, it came in this wonderful Follow Your Heart bag. I'll leave all the stuffs in, in the description box. I'm sorry, I'm looking here, but I should be looking here. I'll leave all the stuffs in the description box. Stuffs meaning where I got it from, who gave me the happy mail, so on, so forth, etc., etc. Um, in Dawn Errands, I received a cool pen that's got a black skull head and a pumpkin, and it's purple. Makes a little snap when you know you've opened all the way, and there you go. It does write really well. I've already written with it. The next thing is, is she shared some of her hand-dyed spun yarn that Spring the Fiber Enthusiast made. Look at that, y'all. And it is it is showing true to color. Yay. This and it's it's wool. Let's see, what do we have here? The fiber is wool. Um, this one also is wool. And they both have sparklies in them. That's well, kind of, I see a little bit in that one. But they both go together. They're not the same weight, but they both go together. So, hmm, could be a cowl. And yes, mm, it smells nice. And I got, and now I've already started working with this, but I frogged it because it just was not working for me. I was making a, a shirt. I think I'm going to either go with a cardigan, a summer cardigan, a Ruana, something a little light. It's, uh, it's pretty busy. So I don't want to do like a t-shirt or something like that. Anyway, it's 100% cotton and it is hand dyed by Erin. Dawn Erin. I don't know why I called her Erin. And there's one of her. She makes these. She doesn't paint them. She sculpts them. It's one of her stitch markers. And it had to be. It's not pink. And it's actually red. I don't know why it's showing up pink. She knows better. <laughs> Anyhow, but look at the detail. Cool, cool, cool. 
I have to ask her again how many yards are in this. It'll help me really figure out what I want. She gifted me this. Well, she gifted me all of this. This is her colorway that she had made. By, you'll have to excuse. Kiva's trying to get to me and let's see. It's the lights of dawn. What? I don't have anything for you. And it's a colorway for Dawn Aaron. And yes, that was the name, the lights of dawn. Dawn grew up in an area where they do have northern lights, so she wanted something to represent her childhood with the northern lights. And it starts off with some really, really pretty blue, baby, baby blue. And Kiva thinks she's going to get a treat. So if you hear her bark, I do apologize. I don't have any more treats. They're all gone. No, no. Now here comes Loki. So I'm sorry. So now we've got some lime green and some red burgundy blue, a little bit of green and black. I mean, it's just beautiful. She does have another colorway exactly like this, but it has sparkle to it. And I want to get a couple of those. And this is from Rena's Thread Crafts. She has an Etsy shop. Was that on here? Nope. But the neat thing is you get this tag that goes along with it. With a little light bulb stitch marker. But the pattern, what does it say? Pattern, pattern link, hook size date started and then underneath it it has the wash instructions what a good idea that is uh, are you gonna focus or no trying to get the last part to focus oh i guess it's still part of the washing instructions it's very small but this color i'm sorry is just right up my alley of course, we get to see the northern lights here. Like I said, when she grew up, she got to see the northern lights also. Oh, please. Okay, next on the list. Yeah, as soon as I hit the on button, Kiva's barking and Dad's like, nope. Shh. So next on the list is I won. Um, just grab it. Right quick. I do have a t-shirt on under that. Looks like I'm half naked. I'm not half naked, y'all. Um, I won a gift from Carrie when she had her birthday live. And I'll tell you what. I'm glad I was at my sister's when I got this because, uh, Wow. When we started discussing the shipping to have it shipped up here, it was going to be way too much. And I was just this close until they remedied, remedied it. I was this close of saying, don't worry about it. Pick something, somebody else or I'll pick somebody else to say it here. This is from blah, 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 all that happy stuff. Well, being that I was at my sister's, it uh, cost a lot less. But anyhow, I won. Uh, I used to be able to pronounce that, but unfortunately, I'm unable to now. But it is a mosaic, as you can see, overlay mosaic crochet blanket. And Anita at y.o.h crochet made one and I was like oh I want that kit I love that color yarn and it the pattern itself 
Well, here is the uh, main color. It's Mary Maxim's Best Value, uh, 342 yards, number four, five millimeter hook, obviously acrylic. This stuff, I did not know how squishy, soft this stuff is. Is that better? It's really, really nice. And I like this color because it's, it, <laughs> having a house with a couple of dogs. Yeah. The color part of it is dye lot. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not sure, but look at that. It's purple. This is going to be a really beautiful blanket because it's got the purples, uh, the really deep reds. This is showing up a lot. Uh, it's getting a little closer to color, but it also has some orange, yellow, a little lighter purple. So, yeah, that'll be... That'll be a project that uh, hopefully will happen this winter. So when I came home or got home, I had an email from Laura, not our Lala. It's one of our subscribers. Oh, sorry about that. Um, she is absolutely one of the smartest people I think I know at this point. Instead of purchasing the yarn and then uh, shipping it, she went to the closest Joann's, which is in the town that we live in. We don't live in town. Anyway. Blah, blah, blah. And she purchased the yarn and said, hey, you've got a package waiting for you at Joann's. And I was like, I do? Okay, so no shipping. She didn't have to pay for shipping. She just chose the yarn. I pick it up. Ta-ta-ra-ta-ta. How ingenious is that? This needs to be a new thing. Needs to be a new thing. Yes. I'm going to be in and out of camera to show you. So, um, first off, stay. I'm, I, I'm so, I feel so blessed to, I just, wow. <laughs> They're, uh, both of these are um, Red Heart Super Saver. This one is 364 yards, 100% acrylic. Um, I'm going to say 6 millimeter according to this. It only shows um, knitting needles. And the color is Buff. Buff. Which will go with this. And this color is Aaron Fleck for, and yes, it's pretty much this 100% acrylic, 260 yards. What do you think? And one just fell out of it. And not did she just get the yarn. Instead of having it bagged up, it's in this super duper awesome I know I'm going to move it and everything is going to fall off. Super duper awesome purple tote. How cool. I mean, come on now. That's just ingenious. She definitely using her noggin. So... The next is Big Twist Rave, and this one is the colorway Cayenne Crush. Pinks, blues, pink and blues. It's a purdy. Stay. 
The next one is a Mandala Gradient in the colorway Light Pink. This doesn't, I mean, it, that's more of a cream color than it is a pink. But here's your pink. I see a nice pretty cowl with this because it's so squishy soft. And last but not least, again, it's a mandala gradient in the colorway bur. Nope, yep, burgundy. I don't think those two would go together. These pinks would clash too much, in, in my opinion. Yeah, that wouldn't be my fave. So while I was at Joanne's picking up this awesome, awesome gift, I found these. Big Twist Cotton for 97 cents. So I bought them all. There was nine of them. Um, Strawberry Stipple is the name of it. And that's pretty true to color. And I'm making Mason a sweater for this winter. And I have three of these, but I figured I better get some more because, you know, kids and that growing thing. I always like to grow. So I got some Heartland in um, Olympic. And this stuff is so soft. I can't wait to start making stuff with it so those were my acquisition that I just showed you in the uh, bags and then ha happy mail gifts from Don Aaron and also from Lara and you all know I don't give out last names and then I got what I won at Carrie's birthday live I do have more things to show, but this is already just shy of a 20-minute video. So I'm going to wait before I actually do a another showing of yarn because I also went to Hobby Lobby while I was in California. So with all of that being said, <laughs> I don't know if you can hear Jeff but he's harassing poor Loki. The chickens are out, so the dogs are locked in, and Loki's like, no, no, I have to be out. I have to be out. So anyhow, I guess I'll go help him round up the chickens and get them put away so Loki can go be with her daddy. I hope everybody had a fairly decent Monday. Uh, let's see. Yep. Pretty much the day is done over with for everybody else but us here. So anyhow, everybody be safe, be kind, and if please, if you are in any path of this next hurricane coming up, please, please, please move inland, go somewhere where you will be safe. Please, it seems like it's gathering steam, more steam than it was supposed to. So anyhow, I know, okay, mom, but we don't want to lose anybody. We love you guys with all of our hearts. Heart? I only have one. I'm not Doctor Who. I don't have two hearts. Anyhow, if you know, you know. Anyhow, everybody have a good day. I'll talk to you soon. Love you.